to soundtrack my life, so oh. yeah. the slower numbers. <laughs> Alright, we'll just all follow you. a bit blue, yeah. Okay. <laughs> just call on you every now and again. No like problem. <laughs> and then the upbeat ones on a feeling perfect. Yeah. What was it initially that first got you all into this sort of swing style of singing and playing? We all really studied it. We all, I mean, I guess we all were into it from an early age, but we all met at music college where everybody was studying on the jazz performance course. Can you mm. believe a jazz performance course yeah. exists? Yeah. I always I know, think it sounds really mighty bush to say it. We're on a, we went yeah. to a, a jazz. Yeah. Yeah. Well, what, what, jazz. what did they teach you? <laughs> Squeak! They teach you that. Did they yeah. teach you the jazz bands yeah. as well. Absolutely. I mean, it's definitely the place to go to meet the people yeah, that you, you kind meet, of want to yeah. go and do stuff with. Yeah. And that's definitely what we got from it more than anything. <clears throat> and I guess a great part of what you do as well is not only taking the older songs, but taking some contemporary songs and yes. rearranging. What components does a contemporary song have to have for you to say, right, we want to do this? We will try any. We will. Yeah. We are but cheap. <laughs> <laughs> not, not everything works. Yeah. Um, and it's, it's hard to define exactly what makes a song work. Mm. It's got to work live. Yeah. It's got to be interesting to perform live. Yeah. And You've got to really brilliant. love the song as well. Yeah. I mean, mm. take, take, for example, Walk Down <coughs> Egyptian. We knew yeah. live that there would be... The moves were kind of obvious it would kind of work in a visual way yeah. and we knew that we could kind of open it up and have fun on, on stage and that that's a big component yeah that's how we can do it live what would you say has been the greatest place that you've played that you've enjoyed the most always enjoy touring america yeah, yeah. So we're just in a six on a 60 foot tour bus and we're just bombing yeah. around america before we finish i've got to ask the buble What's he like? He's, so he's, really nice. he's such a monkey. Lovely. I really want to say something controversial, but I can't. No. Yeah. He is, no. What you see is what you get. He's, he's a cuddly really teddy bear. Yeah. Really? No. I never would have. I never would have. He's a little idiot. Monkey. He's a such a little monkey. <laughs> he's kind of like that irritating older brother that really? kind of pinched on the arse and run off giggly. He's really nice. He's really nice, and he's he's so very good at what he does. He's a consummate professional, yeah. and we learnt a lot from working with him. He's very humble and just enjoys what he does. Yeah. And he doesn't he doesn't take for granted any single minute of what he's doing and, and I think that's very yeah. important for everyone to yeah. kind of well, okay so I was at Torture Garden last year and I'd gone naked and painted in gold and I was there with my husband and the husband and I just we, we just were walking around enjoying the sights and as you do naked as painted you do in gold. naked yep. and painted in gold and then we we walked into this room we didn't quite know what was going on but walked into this room it was called the couple's room, we're a couple, I walk in and it's a, a sea of undulating bodies. The husband gets a little bit frisky and goes to kiss me and, you know, get in with the, with the programme and I just bolted out and then he just couldn't understand why I'd, I'd been so prudish. And the only reason that I bolted out was that because I was covered in gold paint, I just figured I would leave gold paint all over the upholstery in the room. <laughs> Every
everybody in the club would be covered in gold paint afterwards. So you were being a and respectful I would be citizen? Half, well, no, it's just because I thought I would be half covered <laughs> oh, in no. gold paint and half not. Never and everybody else would have bits of gold paint in the club. Who's the slag in the club? The Marcella gold. Papini, ladies and gentlemen, the slag in the club. So I bolted it. <laughs>